Today, guys, we are going to be getting brand new hoverboards, brand new chows, and even riding on a magic carpet with Sonic. That's all I need to say. Let's get right into it. First off, guys, we're not using Sonic. We're using the same lady from last video. We got Rouge right here. Looking so amazing, Rouge. You keep doing your thing. One thing I want to show you guys, Collector's Edition Blue Star. This bad boy right here is absolutely beautiful. It's a hoverboard, I'm pretty sure. And for $7.99, we're going to get it. I'm just going to go ahead and do it right now, guys. I bought that new hoverboard. And off the rip, I've got to see it on my feet. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, look how good that looks. Let's go ahead and throw it on the feet right now. Ooh, Rouge is looking real nice on the board. I wonder if this thing's like faster or anything like that, though. Okay, I'm, I actually don't think it's faster at all. You mean to tell me all this thing is is just a hoverboard? It's not even faster? It even sounds like it's a jet or something like that, guys. I don't know if you all can hear it, but it's pretty loud. Also, something is happening to the left. It says 19 out of 600. I have no idea what that is. I guess we better start checking some of these challenges. We've got Jet's bets. You can see Jet over to the left right now. He's kind of posing for us. And then he's got some missions for us as well. Run at least 250 miles per hour for 10 minutes. That should be pretty easy. Then we've got a hoverboard sky hoops. We need to hit 100 of them. That is a little less easy, but it's fine. Then we've got 100 hoverboard tricks. And then we're going to finish it off with 10 minutes of hoverboard airtime. Hey, at least they don't have those little things to collect. I did not want to have to collect all those things on different maps today. I, I kind of like this update. Also, look at Jet over here, man. He's just chilling on that magic carpet. That is what we're going to have by the end of this video. I'm not going to lie, though. My hoverboard right now, it might be the best. Something I did notice, by the way, peep over here, man. You see Shadow's hat? Why in the world is there a Shadow hat in this game with no Shadow? Please, bring a Shadow in this game. You know what? We'll just keep doing what we got to do. We got to hit these sky rings, and you already know we got to do some tricks with Rouge. And we got to go over 250 miles per hour, man. I don't feel like I'm doing that enough right now. Also, something else I did want to show you guys. There's so much newness to add to this video. But look right here. Metal City is apparently under construction. What could they be doing in there? Let me know what you guys think is going to be in Metal City. Is there going to be a new character? Maybe some new obstacle courses? Metal City in the actual Sonic game is, I'm pretty sure, an obstacle course with, like, hoverboards and stuff. That would be really cool. I'd actually be very excited about that update. But for right now, enough of all that, guys. We got to get to doing some work. 31 out of 600 to the left. Honestly, don't even know what that is. But let's just keep hitting these ramps and hitting these sky rings. We're doing it today. Can we even grind with these hoverboards? I forgot if we can do that or not. Let me actually see if we can. I'm going to try to land on this grinding rail. Okay, I missed. Check me out, though. If I actually try, boy, I don't miss nothing right here. Okay, come on. You already know we were about to explode at least once today. Okay, we can grind. Look at Rouge, by the way. She got it leaned all the way back. Okay, I see you. I see what they did, too, by the way, guys. Watch. I'm going to get back on this rail again. And remember that one challenge where we could just go back and forth, you know, keep grinding until we get that challenge done? Now look at it. It just keeps sending you up until you inevitably get pushed off. But as long as we keep jumping and going this way, okay, it still kind of speeds you up, guys. They really blocked that out. Now it doesn't matter how fast you're going. It's just going to keep you grinding on this rail. You know what? I don't to be on it. We do need to keep hitting these sky rings though. We have a few of them hit, but uh, we need a whole bunch more. We're gonna be checking out every single hoverboard in this update, by the way, guys. Not just this beautiful one. So by the end of today's video, I need to know your favorite hoverboard that we use. Mine right now, obviously, it has to be this beautiful one right here. It's so shiny. And because, you know, I paid a bunch of money for it, so I, I have to like it. I feel like for 799 Robux, though, we should be able to literally fly with this hoverboard. Actually, you know what? Maybe we can. Let's go ahead and gather another speed. See if we can fly off a ramp. I'm going about 220 miles per hour and... Okay. Yep, yeah, we can't fly but what we can do... Yep, we can pretty much do that every single time we play a game. Uh, nothing special. So if you're buying this hoverboard, just know it's pretty much for the looks of it. By the way, guys, since I've been talking, we've hit almost about 30% of these sky rings. I think we literally have about 30 out of the 100 done, so we're making very good progress. And actually, you know what? I don't want to spend my entire time on this map. We're going to a different one. Here we are at Lost Valley, guys. We need to hit a bunch of sky rings on this map because this map right here is a pretty good map for sky rings, if I do remember it correctly. There's a bunch of ramps and nonsense that we can hit. Yeah, look at this. Okay, how did I miss that? That's all right, peep me this time. All right through the ring. You, you already know what I'm saying, though. This map, pretty good for the sky rings. As long as you're hitting them. Don't be missing and all that. You'll be just fine. We've also just hit max level once again. I don't forgot that I rebirthed on this game. We never rebirth at all, man. We just be doing challenges and getting new characters and stuff. Speaking of new characters, let me know in the comments who you all would love to see in this game. Me, personally, I would love to see Shadow. I would love to see, like, Hypersonic, Supersonic. But let me know who you would like to see the most in this game. Let me know down in the comments. Let's 
let's go ahead and check some of our progress, by the way. Okay, look at that, guys. We are making great progress. We almost have everything filled up halfway. We haven't been doing this for a long time either. That's why I'm really loving this update right now. You know what? Off to the next world. Now we are over here on Emerald Hill. Wait a minute. Emerald Hill Obby 1. I have not done that Obby. You know what? We're going to save that for a little bit later. For right now, though, we got to do these challenges. I see a bunch of sky rings I'm able to hit. So you already know me and Rouge right here. We are getting the job done. Oh, and also peep this little sky ring bundle we got going on over here. If you just hit this ramp right here, go straight up and then pull right back. You can hit two for the price of one and then just circle back once more and hit three for the price of one. It's so beautiful on this map. Your boy is an absolute sky ring hunter. Check me out right here. I'm going to hit this ramp sky ring to sky ring and then you see this ramp right here, right? Well, I'm going to hit it, hit another sky ring and then look at this. What do you think I'm going to do? Hit more sky rings in front of me, guys. This is the map for the rings. I thought there were some other better maps for this, but nah, this has got to be Emerald Hill number one. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite map for this challenge is. Mine definitely got to be this map. And to test that theory, let me go ahead and hit two more of these sky rings. Okay, well, I missed that one. But let's check up on the stats right now. We're almost done with the hoverboard tricks. We're almost done with the sky hoops. And we're about halfway done with the miles per hour thing. We are getting close. Just like that, though, guys, peep the left. It says you think you're better than me, do you? Well, Jet, let me go ahead and tell you. I do think we're just a little bit better. Rule, she's got it going on. That also means we have a new... Wait a minute, that's not a hoverboard. That's a whole pack of chows. And you already know we got to evolve all of them to make... Ooh, that's a pretty nice one. It's doing plus 450 on the XP, plus 150 on the rings. But you already know, guys, our other chow's doing so much more for us. So uh, we're going to focus on the hoverboards. I think we only have to hit, like, maybe two more of these rings, by the way. That one might be our last one. Yep, on the left, he said you finally got all the hoops. At least I could have done it faster. He said, although I could have done it faster. You know what, Jet? I did that in pretty good time. And that brought us a smoldering trail. I don't think I'm going to use that one either. So now the only challenges we have to do are the 250 miles per hour and then the 10 minutes of hoverboard air time. So I, I guess let's get some air. I wish there was like a place where we could get high enough to maybe fall for like 10 minutes. That would be very clutch. But sadly, I don't think that's possible. We're probably just going to have to keep hitting ramps and then fall into the ground. At least these ramps over here, you know, you can hit them very high in the air. That takes, you know, a good time to go down. But you know what? Overall, it's still going to take us a pretty good amount of time. Speaking about a time, I need to check out this obby right here. Emerald Hill obby 1. I guess let's go ahead and see what this bad boy is about, and then we'll get back onto the hoverboards. For right now, though, at this level where I can just pretty much jump over everything, it's not that hard. Oh, hold up. I spoke way too soon. All right, so, yeah, we happened to explode. I also don't know where I am at the moment. All right, well, I finally made it up to the top at... Oh, I don't even know what time. Oh, there it is. About 63 seconds. I I'm pretty sure that's horrible, but let me know if that's good or not. Back to that hoverboard life, though. I think it's time for the next map. Now, here we got, you know, we got a couple ramps and nothing really crazy. Actually, this might be a good place for the sky rings, too. I wish I would have tried that out, actually. You know, there are rings pretty much everywhere you look here. And being pretty close to the ramps, I, I like it here. And I like the fact that the ramps are kind of just straight up in the air. That'll give us some hang time for sure. And actually, for right now, guys, I'm just gonna keep continuously hitting these ramps back and forth, trying to get that air time and ultimately trying to get that magic carpet. I'll be right back. Six and a half hours later. All right, guys, we finally did it and we switched over to Hilltop. You can see we got the top three challenges done and now we just need 10 minutes of the hoverboard air time. Guys, we're gonna be getting that very soon. And actually, let's check out that brand new hoverboard. We got the Type J prototype and you know, it is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie to you. You can see that green and stuff kind of looks like Jet's hoverboard, but I'm also not going to lie to you by saying that this one right here, the legendary, it's just superior. And now the mission is to get as much hang time as possible, guys. I'm about to hit all the ramps. And to do that, I think this spot is pretty good right here. You know, back-to-back -back ramps I can continuously hit. So I'm just going to keep doing all these ramps and whatnot. Um, I'll be right back. Eventually. Guys, we have officially done it. Let me go ahead and show you my brand new hoverboard, aka the magic carpet. And if I equipped it, guys, check it out, man. Sonic on his very own magic carpet. Let's see how it rides. It is pretty smooth. Let me hit a trick, though. I'm gonna hit a trick in midair with the magic carpet. This thing is beautiful, man. It matches Sonic so well. And the fact that I can make it look like I'm flying. Check me out. Sonic can just fly through the air on the carpet. Like I said earlier in this video, though, guys, let me know your favorite hoverboard we used today. Was it the magic carpet right here, or was it the brand new legendary hoverboard? Other than that, though, guys, that's the end of this video. I will see you on tomorrow's video. Thank you for watching. I love y'all. Goodbye. I, I